Hello everyone, and it has been a hot second since I've posted on YouTube. I went through a phase where I was posting all the time, and then I just kind of took a week off. I was in Arizona, I was vlogging, and then I realized I brought the completely wrong charger. So that vlog failed epically. That's just never gonna happen. But if you don't follow me on Instagram, then you haven't seen my Instagram pictures from when I was in Arizona, so you should go check that out. Follow me while you're there. Today, I actually got your guys' opinion on Instagram, selfish plug again, about what I should film. The fact of the matter is, is I wanted to film a What's My Bag video because I never got to show you guys what Cody got me for Christmas because it finally came in. And obviously it's a bag, so I really wanted to show you guys. But I'm just kind of like, let's switch it up. Let's do something different. So I'm gonna watch one of the first What's My Bag videos that I have on my channel. So here's the thing, I have two, one's privated, which which I'm not gonna watch because I just don't want to. I'll watch the one that's on my channel so you guys can watch it with me. I don't know why I privated the old one, but I'm sure there's a good reason. This video has 200,000 views, which is just terrifying. So if you don't know, I did a video of like a month and a half ago of me reacting to a tag video that I did 10 years ago because I've been on YouTube for so long. I just want this video to remind everyone to not take anything too seriously. Um, I took it way too serious back in the day and obviously now I'm just here to have fun. Um, I know I look different and that's just life. People change and I'm very happy with the way I have changed. So now that we got that out of the way, Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be doing an update of what's my first video, and I actually Okay, did... can we talk about the Juicy Couture that is in the background? That Daydreamer bag, I still know what it's called. I looked it up how much it was worth. It's like, I think you can buy them on, t on uh, eBay for like 20 bucks, if that. That's original what's my first video. And I'm so cute. I first got my purse, and I'm going to do it. It looks so much like my mom. One of my favorite videos to watch. Just because it's always like girls love to know what other girls carry in their purse. People still use and, that um, disclaimer. I know a lot of people don't like my purse. Oh. So I do. And this is my Coach Poppy spot. I am pretty sure my mom still has that bag in a closet at my apartment. Uh, um, house where I grew up. It's obviously worth a lot of money these days. Um, that was a Coach Poppy bag. I bought that bag because of Blair Fowler. Juicy Star 7. It's a big bag for a 16 year old. It's just kind of bothering me though. It has some things like, it's like style chair on one side. And it's on the other, but it's got this side. I only carry a crook in my arm with that. As like you do. What a fashionista. Yeah. Can we talk about how my nail polish is pretty much the same color as it was in this video? Whatever. So, the bag that I'm going to show you guys is actually a bag probably from around the same era. I'm just kidding. I'm pretty sure this is like 15 years old. It is a Louis Vuitton denim vintage crossbody bag. I think they call this the camera bag. I've wanted an item from the denim connection, denim collection since I cannot, like since it came out in 2000, what, 6, 2000? And it's finally mine, all thanks to Cody. So thank you so much, Cody. I love it. And um, we're going to go into the contents that are in this bag. Let me know in the comments below which bag you prefer. Do you prefer this Louis Vuitton or you prefer my Coach Poppy bag? I got this at the Coach outlet in February and I love it and I've used it. I only use it when I go shopping. Because during the weekdays I only bring like I don't know why I thought I needed a big bag like, like that. I mean obviously it was like what was in style. Or a wristlet because I also but I was in high school. First thing is in this bucket, like before I just keep the little ugly one, the key fob thing that comes with it. I don't have anything like that in my bag currently. And I don't keep anything in these pockets. I don't keep anything in this front compartment of my bag, except it's a nice contrast of how through the years the coloring has faded and got really dirty. That's actually the first time I've opened that compartment. So this is what it looks like on the inside. Purple, so that's pretty yellow. It's heavy. My mom always thinks it's that pretty light. Like my legitimate. What's my first video? I hate it when girls like. Okay, here's the thing. Um, I was saying that I hate when people like plant stuff in their bags for a what's my bag video. I was the epitome of that. I did that. I said I didn't do that, but I definitely did do that. So um, I don't remember like obviously what was in my bag, but I know for a fact I would go around my room and be like, okay, what can I talk about the, in, and put it in my bag. So that's the only thing I actually planted in my bag this time is something, well, my wallet because it was sitting on the coffee table and I knew I'd lose it but also my airpods because I misplaced my airpods and it like starts a 
heated debate between Cody and I about where I put it and then I like start tearing up because I'm like I lost the gift you gave me and this way I can avoid that argument. So like I'm pretty sure all of our fights uh, stem from where are my AirPods. It's just sitting in my bag. First things first, Ooh, it's in there. Is my wallet. Um, I have this wallet a horrible have wallet. So I use the same wallet that I've been using for years. I've been using the same wallet that I've used in like the past billion what's in my bag videos. So some things never change. Carries the same thing that's always carried in my my wallet. I don't carry cash. I never do. It's a bad $11. thing. So I had more money then than I did now. <laughs> Oh, and then I also put like every card possible in my card holder. Like their reward cards. I had a New York City Metro card. Oh, subway card in there too. Um, my camera. Okay. It's a really old camera. I got this for my 15th birthday. That sound is like vintage. Okay. I still carry a camera actually. This was not planted in my bag, I promise. Um, we just got back from Arizona. I try to keep a film camera with me. This is just so happens to be the one that I'm currently shooting on. I'm waiting to get some film back from Arizona to see if this actually worked. But yeah, this is a Nikon Light Touch Zoom 120 ED. I paid a whole six dollars for it. I have a ticket stub for the wand. I have a ton of receipts. No ticket stubs. Oh, and some paint samples. And I also have a bunch. I have. McDonald's, of course. I have my car key. Just chilling. I don't even have my car keys in my purse right now. That's good. Gonna have to try to find those later. Yep. Um. I really wanted people to know that I had a car, even though it was technically my mom's car. Don't laugh at me and be like, that's not legitimately what's in purse. But I have these glasses. An example of something being planted in my purse. These are my legitimate glasses. These are just... I don't know why I would be carrying those around. I thought I looked like cute, cool and like a little hipster kid. Um, the sunglasses that I currently carry with me are not really even sunglasses. I wore these majority of the time in Arizona. They need to be put in their case because I'm afraid they're going to get scratched because they took me forever to find them. Gucci from... I saw them on HRH Collection. I was like, do you got to find those. So I did my homework. But here they are. I got these in mind for Coachella. I was like, those are a vibe. I need them. So I got them. Here they are. I bought them on Poshmark for like $200. That wasn't the same day. This was the night I went to Starbucks and I wore these everywhere. So that's why they're in there. I, you can have my I wore those to Starbucks. That's terrifying. No wonder I, I know one person that I talked to still from high school. No wonder. I got a scrunchie. I'm sorry if this video is not as entertaining as I thought it would be. Then I have a pen. I don't have a pen, but I do have a lip liner. This is a Berry M lip liner in Reset. I got this when I was in England last year. I miss England. Oh, an iPod Touch? Nothing to make me feel older than an iPod Touch. Holy crap. My Audrey Hepburn phase. <laughs> Long live. Well, now I have my AirPods, which I already showed you guys because I wanted to make sure I actually kept them in my bag so I wouldn't lose them. Um, I have three more receipts in here. Change in here. Okay, so we're getting to the end. So I'm going to show you, like I do in this video, what I have in here. This is my iPod. This is not my iPod. This is my phone. Oh my god. This is my phone. I have my phone and this is from luxaddiction.com. Do you guys remember these um, cases? This, this is so tacky. It's a juicy. Really what is this from? I'm like Kenzie Elizabeth. Oh my god. I do have an iPhone. I just didn't have it in my bag. Um, when I was hiking up the trail in Arizona or in Sedona, um, I had this bag with me and we met a guy, which apparently he's like famous for doing this. He like gives everyone a heart from Mother Earth and he tells you to keep it with you. So I obviously I had to keep it with me um, and it was in my bag this entire time. So I need to put this somewhere special. Or that was not put in there on purpose. That was just literally what was in my bag. I have this cute case from Lux Addiction. I'm not really that crazy about this. I guess I'll just go through the remnants of this purse. I have 
got an eyelash um, thing for my eyelash extensions. My friend Danielle is going to be thrilled to see that it's in the bottom of my purse and not being used. Um, Lash Out Nashville is where I get my lashes done. I have another lip liner. I have my favorite lip glosses is NARS No Regrets. And this chapstick is from NARS. And then I have two lipsticks. So this is my old favorite. This is Adore by Marc Jacobs. And my new favorite, this is Serene by It Cosmetics. And now that I look at them, they're pretty close in color. Pretty close. And then I have another eyelash thing. And then I got one of these Choco Starlight Mints at the Mexican restaurant that I went to in Arizona. And I've been saving this and I completely forgot about it. So I'm totally eating this after that. And that is what is in my purse. That's it. That's what's in my bag. As you can see, this bag is pretty small. Doesn't have a lot of structure to it, but it can fit a whole lot of stuff in there. Um, my sunglasses and my camera take up a lot of space, obviously. Um, not quite as much as what the bag I was carrying back in 2010 did, but alas, what can you do? Yeah, I just like in the queen of just putting crap at the bottom, like I didn't. Like when I get change, I just throw it in my purse. I don't really bother putting it away. It's just... I'm still the same. Except now I kind of put it in like the little um, coin section. Well, not even the coin section, it's for your drinks in the car. Um, it's where I end up putting it most of the time. And if I look like I'm rushing this video, it's because I was running out of memory. I literally have five that seconds left. That was it. I'm just gonna stop it there. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, let me know in the comments below if you want me to, me to see me continue to do these kind of videos. And until next time, I will talk to y'all later. Bye!